Hey guys, today I wanted to show you a huge animal Black Friday haul. Some of the stuff I've already used, so I will talk about it um, and insert clips at the end of like the stuff that I've already used. I tried keeping the things I'm using to a minimum, but um, it was taking a long time to get to stuff to get here, and I didn't want to film this twice. So now it's overflowing my pet room, and I need to put everything away so my ferrets have more space to play. So let's just go through. Um, first I got two 29 gallon tanks and two conversion kit lids. The conversion kit lids are not here yet. Um, but when those get here, I will do a video on how to attach those because it's super easy, but just in case anyone was wondering, um, the next big things I got, I got three or four of these big, huge care fresh packages. I actually think I got four of them. Um, I like to use this care fresh for my ferrets to dig in. I like to use it for my hamster, for my mice. Um, and it was like buy two, get one free or something. So I got four of these. A lot of stuff on Chewy was buy two, get one free, like mix and match. So I got a lot of stuff, like multiples of things. And obviously this is not all stuff I'm going to need like now, but I figured I may as well buy it while it's on sale and then, um, have it on hand. So I spent a lot now, but it's to save me money in the long run because this is stuff I'm obviously going to need. Um, so here's one of my receipts. So I'm just gonna go through and grab randomly out of this huge box that's over here. I got this little chew toy by Oxbow for my mice. I thought they would like it. It has like a wicker, a wicker ball thing in it. Um, and then it has this cardboard. So I thought I would give this to them for something to do because they do like to chew on these kind of things. And I think I'm just gonna throw this stuff on the ground and then I'll pick it up later. Um, I also got this chew toy for them. It's like strings coming out of a wooden stick or something. A lot of these chew toys were super discounted. Sir, can you not rip that open please? He's like, give me the care fresh. I want the care fresh. And we're like, no, sir, no. I also got this little chew toy. I think a lot of these little chew toys were like a dollar each or something. So I just got a whole bunch because my mice go through chew toys like crazy. I got three of these mealworm dishes by Smart Dish. These are not the dishes that I normally use. And there wasn't even a picture on Chewy. So I kind of just took a shot in the dark. Um, I'm hoping they're not going to be too tall for my leopard geckos to stick their face in and hunt, like get the worms out of. Um, so I have three of these. I'll try it out. I might end up having to return the two I don't use if uh, this is too big because it is kind of tall. There is no dimensions, but I'll try it out. Um, I like to feed my Leos in dishes when they have mealworms just so the mealworms don't escape because I have found beetles in there before um just because they have substrate so they can just burrow so this helps them give a fighting chance for when they eat mealworms when they have crickets or something obviously I let them hunt but mealworms they just I got a couple of these fake vines these are the pothos by flukers I love these. I use these in a lot of different builds. And since I got Damon, his tank is kind of bare. So I wanted to get some stuff to spruce it up as well as, I guess I'll just say it now. One of the things I got for Black Friday, I used Jessica Animal Friends um, video she posted on Cyber Monday and used her coupon code to get two frogs. So I'm going to pick those up on Friday and I'm going to have their tanks and stuff set up and then I'll introduce you to them. Um, maybe I'll do an unboxing. I'm not sure, but stay tuned for that to be able to see what frogs I got. I'm super excited. Uh, so yeah, I got two of these uh, vines. I got this hanging monkey hammock. I like the hammocks that my ferrets can hang out together. So I got this one. It's kind of like that other one I have, but my other one's a sloth, I think. So they can go in the mouth. It's like basically a tunnel. They can come out here and just hang out. Two of my ferrets fight over that hammock, so I thought I'd get another one. Um, I also got this jumbo hammock so they can sleep together because it's funny. They like pile. They pile up, which is cute, but it's probably not the comfiest thing. So I got this really, really big hammock. 
like a rectangle. So I'll put that in there for them so they can fit together a little better. And I got two of those. And luckily I got two different colors too. So I got a black and white zebra one. And then I got the cheetah one. So that's really cool. I like that. And these didn't have dimensions either, but I just read the reviews and I've used the smaller version of these before um, when I had my rats. And obviously the, the ferrets can still use them, but they just can't all fit together because ferrets are bigger than rats. Man, what are you doing, ma'am? Sir, why are you tearing that apart? This is why we can't have nice things. Let go. Destroying the care fresh like it's not expensive. That obviously needs to be put away. Okay, now you move on to these ones. We don't need to tear the care fresh open. It's not nice to do. That was really loud, so I decided to just take it out first. Um, next, I got this coconut house. And I just realized that this is not attached. So I'm going to have to figure out how to attach it so I can hang it. But um, I saw that this had three holes punched in it, which I thought was really cool. I've never seen one like that. And I thought Branch would really like this because I've heard a lot of um, crusted geckos like it if there's more than one exit hole. So I got this one from Chewy. Um, most of the stuff's from Chewy. If it's not from Chewy, I'll mention it. Otherwise, assume it's from Chewy. Um, these two I got from Petco, actually. I think it was Buy One, Get One Free or something of the Nature's Miracle cage cleaner. I like to use this in my ferrets to clean out the bottom pan liner. Um, and then in my rodents. I don't use it in my reptiles unless I have literally nothing else, but usually I use a vinegar mixture for them. I got this piece of wood that's actually pretty cool. I might give it to my snake who is actually out right now chilling, which is fun because he's never out. Um, but I think this is really nice or I'll, I could even give it to um, Damon. So, cause that would be a nice thing to climb up on and chill, get a view. So I don't know. I got some ferret treats, which I'm going to have to put back in the box. Otherwise they are going to go crazy. These are the bandits. Um, treats and literally the only ingredients is duck and duck liver so I like to give these to them they like them it's just a fun little treat um I also got three of the Reptisun UVB 10.0 UVB bulbs these are the ones I use for my leopard geckos so I thought right now while they're by two get one free I may as well get them because I do I will have to change them out eventually I got this from Petco, uh, PetSmart actually, to um, have a mister in here because I have my other mister out there for Branch and Alark, and then I'll have this one in here for my frogs and my snake. And then with that kit, it gave me a bunch of coupons, so most of them um, Salazar, my snake, already has, but um, I also got this 13 watt UBB bulb that would fit in the one Damon has, and then I got these freeze dried mealworms for my mice. I also got this ferret ear cleaner. Um, I feel like I bought this on a whim. I actually don't know if this is safe. I'm going to do research on it, but if you know anything about this, can you please let me know? I'm going to do research and see if it's helpful because my one of my ferrets ears gets really, really dirty. So I don't know. I'm not going to use it till I know it's safe, but I did buy it. Here is another piece of that wood. Um, maybe put it like this, I don't know. So this one has a couple little holes that my snake would fit through. Here is some stuff I got from my local pet store. I got the BioDude Biodegradables. It's basically sphagnum moss. Um, I have a lot of this in my snakes container and I knew I was gonna need a lot for my frogs, so I got that. I also got this as substrate for my frogs, the Terra Fauna, because I'm going to do a bioactive setup. Um, I got a screen mesh, and then I got this terrarium moss. Um, I think it mainly looks nice. I think it's not as good at holding water, but I don't know. I have no idea. I just got it because I thought it looked good. 
Next, I got some ferret food. This is one of the three foods I mixed together for my ferrets. I'm trying to get them off the KT food, but um, two of my ferrets, the original two I got, were kind of neglected and given really crappy food. So I got them on this, which is a little better than what they were eating, but I have to mix it, so. So go eat. I got this large jungle plant. So this will be for my frogs probably. I got a cork round that'll be for my frogs probably. Here is the Wysong food that they eat. It is the Fair Epigen 90 starch free. So this is what I mixed with the KT food and I'm already trying to get into the KT food. So these two I mix together and then sometimes, is this the chicken one? Sometimes I'll get the turkey one depending on what's available because they'll eat either of those. Here is another Lucas vine. This is English Ivy. And then I have this bungee toy. I'm gonna to tie it to the outside of the cage. I'm not going to tie it in their cage, obviously, because uh, I don't want them to have access to it when I'm not supervising them. But they will have this for outside of their cage. Um, and then the only other thing in there is the last thing of Carefresh. So this is my rough green tree snake, Salazar. I got this. Um, little skull hide for him. I also got some of this cypress mulch from um, Petco. And then I got this like log hide. It's pretty cool. It has a tunnel underneath and stuff. Um, but yeah, there he is. So you can get a little idea of what he looks like. He is super cute. Look at that little guy. So I think that is everything I got for Black Friday. I got so much stuff. Um, I thought it'd be better to just buy a ton of stuff right now because I will need it eventually um and then excuse me and then save some money in the long run so I need to put all this stuff away the first are getting into it I hope you enjoyed please like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time